So I guess it's kind of like a really? I don't know. Okay. I promised I would do a wall climbing tutorial. So here we go. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to point this, you know, regular point, and with both hands. And it's kind of like wall climbing, but weirder, I guess. <laughs> okay, so you kind of like push like this, but you also need to push like in. And so what I do is I kind of do this like diagonal, but it, the the starting point is in the rock, and then. It goes out, so I go up, and then I do that. Okay, so I'm gonna show you six. Uh, I mean, they <laughs> a a quick representation. Um. Uh, and so you just kind of do this, and then I'm also gonna show you how to do this. Ooh, that scared me. Okay. <laughs> Let's... Ooh. Of course, I had to go. I mean, fall. Okay. Okay. So... You... It's kind of hard to explain. But when you get to... When you, like... It, like, you, all you need to do is just, like, start practicing. There are different ways. You could just do it like this. But for me, that's harder. Because when you point, this is now counted as, like, part of your band. Because, as usual, uh, when it's, uh, like, when your hand is like this, uh... There's, all these fingers don't have a hitbox, and so when you do this, uh, yeah, I'm gonna turn this off. Okay, and so it creates an extra hitbox, and so it's easier. But you can also just do it like this if you're used to this. I, I can somewhat do it, but it's kind of weird. Um, but yeah. When you get to when you get to this big part right here, uh, you're gonna want to just do the regular wall climbing, but make sure you don't fall. You can go as high as you want, but I recommend going low, cause like maybe right around here. And then start wall climbing if you're playing infection because uh, it's harder for the girls that are still getting used to it <laughs> to do that if they did not practice that way. But yeah, uh, I practiced it like all the way up here. So, like, what I did is I got all the way up here and then I just started wall running. Oh my god, that's always scaring me. Okay, and then, um, so, we should do the wall run. Okay, so, first, I'm going to say that some people call that wall running when you climb up there, and then some people call that wall climbing. I call that wall climbing, and then I call this wall running but some people call it like wall running when you go down there and then wall climbing when you go up here so just like a quick like if there, if there's a misunderstanding then <laughs> don't say i warn you or i didn't warn you but um uh yeah and so how you do it is basically just do the same thing that you did to climb this, uh, which you, you, you point, and 
then you there's like you need to be sure because hmm. it's just, just like doing like up and down. I you can see I started falling and yeah, you need to have like a more diagonal so it's kind of like a really slanted diagonal like that. And so it's like do that and push like that. And so do that. You don't really need to like push like in or like do that. You don't really need to do that. Uh but on the wall climbing part you kinda need to do that. Uh so you don't like it's just fine if you like maybe when you're first beginning you kinda go like all the way over there <laughs> Um like or if you like fall off like um it's completely fine, but yeah. I, like, sometimes when I'm panicking, I, like, because, <laughs> like, if a little monkey's chasing you, you're going to sort of panic sometimes. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. Make sure you get lots of practice. So, yeah. Adios.